Under the general topic of cumulative distribution functions, the first subtopic was percentiles, and we are done with those. The second subtopic is random variate generation. Here are some applications of uh, Monte Carlo simulation, which is where random variate generation is going to appear. The first one is that Monte Carlo simulation can be used to support an analytic solution to a probability problem. So you may work a probability problem by hand, be a little bit nervous about that solution. And one thing that you can do is you can come in and run a Monte Carlo simulation and that will support the analytic solution. Notice that this support here is not the same as verify. It doesn't prove it's right. It just gives you a lot more confidence that your analytic solution is right. The second reason Monte Carlo shows up is it can be used for solving problems that do not have analytic solutions. Some of these probability problems, if you just tweak them a little bit, they get so difficult that you can't solve them analytically anymore, and Monte Carlo comes to the rescue. So we saw a little bit of Monte Carlo last chapter. The purpose here is to extend that Monte Carlo to random variables. Here's a well-known result in probability theory. It's known as the probability integral transformation is one of the top results in probability theory. It states that if x is a random variable with cumulative distribution function capital F of x, then capital F of capital X, now this is a quantity that we have not seen before and that is you take a random variable x and you transform it by its own CDF. Well, it turns out that is uniformly distributed between 0 and 1. Some shorthand for this that we're going to use a little bit later, but I'll go ahead and introduce it now, is capital F of capital X is distributed as, that's this squiggle here, a uniform 0, 1 random variable. Now, there's no proof of that here, but uh, nevertheless, that's an important result, and it allows us to generate random variates. First of all, what is a random variate and how is it different from a random variable? You remember that a random variable was a mapping from the outcome of a random experiment to a real number. A random variate is a, an instantiation of a random variable, usually done on a computer but you can do them by hand as well. It's just they're faster on a computer. The procedure for coming up with a random variant is you generate u where u has the uniform distribution between 0 and 1. Another way of saying that is you take a random number and you plug it into the inverse cumulative distribution function and out will pop a random variant x. If you want to see the geometry of what is going on here, here is x and here is f of x. So remember if we have f of x that will lie between 0 and 1 because it's a probability and let me go ahead and put a dashed line here for the cumulative distribution function. If you have a cumulative distribution function, let's say, that looks like this, what you are doing here is you are generating a uniform 0, 1. And I can choose any value along this axis. Let me go with this right here. Let's say we have a u here of about, I don't know, 3 quarters or so. Well, if you come across to the CDF and then you come down, my pen is fading away here. There we go, finally. 
then this value right here is your x value. That f inverse of u is the random variate that you generate. And that is given down below. So that's random variate generation. In the uh, next slide, we'll illustrate that.